Atlassian Corporation PLC is an Australian enterprise software company that develops products for software developers, project managers, and content management. It is best known for its issue tracking application, Jira, and its team collaboration and wiki product, Confluence. Atlassian serves over 120,000 customers. Topic history Mike Cannon Brooks and Scott Farquhar founded Atlassian in 2002. The pair met while studying at the University of New South Wales in Sydney. They bootstrapped the company for several years, financing the startup with a $10,000 credit card debt. The name derives from the Titan Atlas from Greek mythology, who had been punished to hold up the heavens after the Greek gods had overthrown the Titans. This was reflected in the company's logo used from 2011 through to the 2017 rebranding through a blue X shaped figure holding up what is shown to be the bottom of the sky. Atlassian released its flagship product, Jira, a project and issue tracker, in 2002. In 2004, it released Confluence, a team collaboration platform that lets users work together on projects, co create content, and share documents and other media assets. In 2006, Cannon Brooks and Farquhar were named Ernst & Young's Entrepreneurs of the Year for Australia. In July 2010, Atlassian raised $60 million in venture capital from Excel Partners. In June 2011, Atlassian announced revenue of $102 million, up 35% from the year before. In August 2011, Jay Simons became president, while Cannon Brooks and Farquhar kept their positions as co chief executive. For the June 2014 fiscal year, Atlassian reported $215 million in revenue, up from $144 million in 2013. In a 2014 restructuring, the parent company became Atlassian Corporation PLC of the UK, with a registered address in London, though the actual headquarters remained in Sydney. Atlassian has offices in five countries Amsterdam in the Netherlands, Austin, San Francisco, and Mountain View, California, in the United States, Manila in the Philippines, Yokohama in Japan, and Sydney in Australia. The group has over 2,200 employees serving more than 60,000 customers and millions of users. In November 2015, Atlassian announced sales of $320 million, and Shona Brown was added to its board. On 10 December 2015 Atlassian made its initial public offering IPO on the Nasdaq Stock Exchange, under the symbol team, putting the market capitalization of Atlassian at $4.37 billion. Topic. Sales setup Atlassian has been noted for not using a traditional sales team, instead relying on its website. Topic. Acquisitions and product announcements In 2010, Atlassian acquired Bitbucket, a hosted service for code collaboration. In May 2012, Atlassian Marketplace was introduced as a website where customers can download plugins for various Atlassian products. That year, Atlassian also released Stash, a Git repository for enterprises, later renamed Bitbucket Server. Additional products include Crucible, Fisheye, Bamboo, and Clover, which target programmers working with a code base. Fisheye, Crucible, and Clover came into Atlassian's portfolio through the acquisition of another Australian software company, Kekwa, in 2007. In 2012, Atlassian acquired HipChat, an instant messenger for workplace environments. Doug Burgum became chairman of its board of directors in July 2012. In 2013, Atlassian announced a Jira service desk product with full service level agreement support. Sourcetree is a Git and Mercurial desktop client for developers on Mac or Windows. In 2015, it announced its acquisition of work chat company Hall, with the intention of migrating all of Hall's customers across to its own chat product HipChat, a small startup called Dogwood Labs in Denver, Colorado, which had a product called Status Page, was acquired in July 2016. In January 2017, Atlassian announced the purchase of Trello for $425 million. On the 7th of September 2017, the company launched Stride, a web chat alternative to Slack. Less than a year later, on 26 July 2018, Atlassian announced it was going to exit the chat business, that it had sold the intellectual property for HipChat and Stride to competitor Slack, and that it was going shut down HipChat and Stride in 2019. On 4 September 2018 the company acquired Opsgini for $295 million. Philanthropy. <laughs> <laughs> 
In March 2011, the company raised $1 million for the charity room to read from sales of its $10 starter licenses.